Hello punters and welcome to another episode of Multiverses. I'm Ryan Cook, he's James Coglin. James, the powers that be have given you another $50 to play with. And I'm not sure why, because <laughs> last week you fell over by a single goal. Walk us through it, mate. Look, it was just sickening. I mean, Man United, another reason to dislike them as a club. They came so close, but couldn't score a goal after going down to 10 men. I'm almost over it, but can we just move on, please? Yeah, let's do it. Premier League again. Come on, fire up. All right, well, I'm going to start with Arsenal to win and over two and a half goals the Gunners had a good Champions League win midweek so I'm gonna stick with them to keep rolling in their fixture uh, Leicester Bournemouth both teams to score I'm also gonna go both teams to score in West Ham Ipswich that's been a great bet for Ipswich in the last few weeks even though they've played out a bunch of draws and finally I'm gonna go Everton Newcastle over two and a half goals I uh, feel like there's a lot of attacking play here and Everton well I've pretty much said every week how much they suck defensively. So uh, let's <laughs> stick with that. Getting us a nice $5.67. Getting close. Come on, this has got to be the week. I'll give you some credit. You are getting very, very close each week. So look, hopefully this one gets up. We need it. I'm going all in on the NRL Grand Final. I've gone big. Uh, I've got four legs for you. I like the Storm to win. I think they just win the battle up forward. And we saw the Sharks play the Panthers close in the first half last week. Think they could be vulnerable this year. I like the Storm under 19 and a half points. Panthers have held their last 11 finals opponents to under 9.6 points. Uh, I like Ryan Pappenhausen any time in that game. Think the Hughes and Pappenhausen combo could be a problem for Jerome Luai and uh, Brian Toto any time. $65.07 for this one, James, if you don't mind. Go big or go home, but uh, I hate to say it, I like the Panthers to win. Oh, I don't do that to me. Don't put the mockers on me. All right, let's get into the joint multi. I talked you out of the Raiders last week. Thank I'm going to go first up in the NFL this week. Uh, I like the Vikings to win. We've seen Aaron Rodgers less than 100% last week, hobbling around the field. Chemistry looks off for some of his receivers. And I like the Cowboys to win. Missing a couple of uh, key defensive pieces as well, but coming off that extended break, I think they're good value. You. What have you got for us? Yeah, I like that Cowboys to bounce back as well. I've got the Washington surprisingly professional football team, otherwise known as the Commanders. I've got them to cover the line in their game. Jaden Daniels looks ridiculously good, giving me shades of 2012 Robert Griffin III, just mm. hopefully with a better ending to that rookie season. <laughs> and uh, I'm also going to go with the Baltimore Ravens to win because, well, King Henry, he is immense right now, just running through, around, over anybody. To recap, we've got the Vikings to win, Cowboys to win, Commanders to cover, Ravens to win, $12.18. I like that. Fingers crossed, James. Chances are you're about to lose. For free and confidential support, call the number on the screen or visit the website.